Hello everyone, Moonlight Dragon here. Today I am going to talk a little bit about this trend that is going around the Wings of Fire YouTube community. Wings of Fire Confessions. If you haven't heard of this or seen any of the videos, basically the idea of this trend is to share around your opinions about the series and it usually comes in the form of white text on a screen that has art of whatever character you're talking about and then music in the background. Usually the videos look something like this. It's a cute trend, there's nothing inherently wrong with it, but there's actually a big problem with a lot of the videos that I see posted. So, so many of these videos are absolutely filled with stolen art. Okay, before I fully begin, please, please do not harass anyone who has done this trend. If you have done this trend yourself, don't feel bad. Just please hear me out as I explain the problem with this. A lot of people in this community are kids, and chances are 99% of the people doing this aren't doing it intentionally. They just want to make a fun video, but what they don't realize is that just because someone posts a piece of art online doesn't mean it's public domain. I tried looking up Wings of Fire confessions, and I counted the first 15 results. Out of those videos, 10 of them, two-thirds of the ones that I looked at, didn't credit a single artist. Out of those 10, four of them said, this art does not belong to me, or something along those lines. So, let me explain. Credit to the original artist is not adequate credit. You might as well not credit the artist at all. It's still art theft. And it's really frustrating to see someone say something along the lines of credit to the original artist because you're not actually giving credit to the original artist. If you rob a bank and then you try to buy something with the money but then say, this isn't actually my money, then that doesn't mean that you didn't rob the bank, <laughs> if you get what I'm saying. It's still art theft, and it basically does nothing to help. Out of the remaining five videos, two of them posted credits for one to two artists, and then none of the others. And three of them posted full credits of all the artists' art that they featured. Only three out of 15 videos properly credited the artists. Keep in mind that most of these videos have an average of 10 to 15 pieces in this video, some have more, and each individual piece that they are featuring likely took an artist hours and hours to create and perfect. And not only did you not ask permission to feature their hard work in your video, you didn't even credit them. Imagine working for hours on a drawing or really any piece of work that you're proud of only to have someone else over the internet use it without saying anything about how you made that piece. If you're going to use someone's art, please, please, please at least say their username. Even better, link their social media. Say you see a piece of art that you love in someone else's video, and the person who posted it also put a link in the description. That means that you can follow the link to that person's channel or other social media and see other art that you like. That means that in exchange for letting someone else use their art, that creator gets more exposure. Another thing that you really, really have to do is ask the creator first to use their art. Some people don't like it when people repost their art, even with credit. Some people are going to say no when you ask them. A lot of people are, but that prevents you possibly taking their art without even asking them, and then possibly having to take the video down because you're taking someone else's piece that they worked hard on and don't want you using. So you need to ask the creator. On the other hand, there might be people who have in their YouTube description or their bio for whatever social media that says, you can repost my art without having to ask as long as you give proper credit. Just make sure to check those things so that you know, do I have to ask? 
do I have to give credit? Usually you're going to have to give credit and you're going to have to ask. It's a lot more work than just taking two seconds to find some art that you don't even know who the artist is, but it's the right thing to do and you avoid possibly having to take the video down because you accidentally stole someone else's art. And say there's a piece of art that you like and a creator notices that you took their art. If you admire a piece of artwork, then you need to get off on the right foot with the creator. <laughs> you don't want to have your first interaction with a creator who's made a piece that you admire be having stolen their art. So, a few excuses that I see a lot are, why would you post this piece online if you didn't want other people to use it? Which doesn't make any sense because you can post something online so that other people can see it and it shouldn't be too much to ask that you can post works online and not have someone else take it. And even possibly other people might think that it is your own work. I'm assuming that most of the people here are not going to want to intentionally steal art. That is a whole nother issue that maybe we can talk about some other time. Intentional art thieves. These are not intentional art thieves. These are people who just want to make a fun video. And it's easy to understand why that they would just see a piece of art and use it. But you can't do that. Another thing that I see a lot is, I just found the picture over Google Images or through someone else who posted the art without credit. If I don't know who the artist is, but I still want to post the art, then how am I supposed to find the artist? It's really as simple as a reverse Google image search. If that doesn't work and you still can't find the artist, do not post the art anyway. Find another piece to use in your video. I've seen, I couldn't find the original artist, but this piece is not mine. And it really doesn't help, even with the addition of, if this is your piece of art, I will give credit. Because chances are likely that that artist isn't going to see it. It really doesn't help. You're still using another person's intellectual property and not giving them proper credit, and that is still art theft. So far, I haven't featured any specific videos yet because I don't want anyone going after the people who posted them. That's obviously not a good thing to do. Please do not do that. I've already said that, but please do not do that. But I am going to share one video that I found by Soul Do the Nightwing Leafwing because they actually made their own art for the video. It was really refreshing to see someone put effort into creating a video. I know I've kind of been ranting for the entire video, but this is a Moonlight video. We can't go a whole video without doing something wholesome, obviously. So please, go like, comment, subscribe to this person, do whatever, because their art style is really adorable and they deserve it for being the first person that I saw who actually put the effort into creating their own thing rather than just doing what everyone else was doing. All in all, there really isn't much I can do about the situation. Art theft has, and probably always will be, common in the Wings of Fire community. The purpose of making this video was that hopefully I'll have someone who watches this video who's interested in doing this trend, and if this video can convince that person to ask permission and credit the artist properly when they include art in their videos, then that alone is helping those 10-15 to 15 artists who would have otherwise had their content stolen. This is my first art commentary video. I would really love to thank Weird for making the sprites that I used in this video. I have linked her YouTube channel in the iCard section and in the description and sent her some love. In addition, I have also linked in the description the three artists whose art I used to show an example of what the confession videos are like, and I got full permission from them to post these because if I didn't, that would kind of defeat the purpose of the video. But please do let me know if you want to see more of this kind of video in the future. Have a great day, and I will see you guys next time.